why they didn't do more for him. But three times they kept him a week and let him go. Give him medicine and let him go. The grandmother of the man shot and killed by a Mobile County Sheriff's deputy says her grandson needed mental help. Bernie Wade Johnson Jr. was killed after authorities say he came at a deputy with a hammer outside the Walmart in Sims. News 5's Katarina Lukatich is live this morning from the Sheriff's Office with more on what J Johnson's family is saying this morning. Good morning, Kat. Hey, good morning, Bill and Jessica. Well, Bernie Johnson's grandmother says that he was a paranoid schizophrenic, and she says his family had been trying to get him help for a long time before yesterday's deadly encounter. Now, witnesses tell us that Johnson was walking out of the Walmart in Sims with more than $1,000 worth of electronics. Associates tried stopping him, but witnesses say he grabbed a hammer that was sitting just outside of the store's entrance. The sheriff's office says when a deputy got there, he saw Johnson walking across the parking lot. Witnesses reported to authorities that they heard Johnson threaten the deputy before the shooting. There are a number of witnesses who heard the suspect loudly stating, you're going to kill me or I'm going to kill you, as he's advancing on the deputy with a raised claw. I think he, the voice has got so many. I think he wanted that to happen. Johnson's grandmother says she hopes this situation can help bring awareness to mental, mental health and help make access easier for those who need it. As for the deputy who fired the fatal shot, as with any officer involved shooting, there will be an internal investigation. Reporting live at the Sheriff's Office, Katarina Luktich, WKRG News 5.